Hey guys, today we're going to be doing a hide and seek video. So, let's get started. Yes, I am in the bathroom for no reason. At all. Dark. 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 The number one spot. This is a big one. First, if you ever have had a trick. If you have a treadmill and it's against the wall, like me, and two things on the sides are blocking it, which you probably will if you have one. Get it down slowly. I have a bike back here. So. See that little spot? It may not be much, but once you close it, there will be, like, from here to all the way to the wall. That's how much space you'll have. And then you will have someone else put it up. And if it is against the wall, you'll, you can have a little bit of space. I have this here, so it's a little harder. I hurt my back last night with it. But you can see how there's a little bit of space. For me. And that's how I would get out for, to help other people in. Because I would do all this, and then they... Wait, I gotta turn off the light. But then they... Would get in there. I would shut it. I would climb up on that, then onto that, the wood, which is really stable for some reason. Then I would go down into that little entry, and and then we would hide. Also, right back here is a little spot that that my friend used last night. Also, so. So when you put it back, boom, off to the next one. If you have anything against to a corner of a wall, good. You can always hide back here, especially for dark hiding cheek, like in the dark without any lights. Well, I blocked it off because I didn't like people hiding in, under there with a suitcase that fits perfectly. And uh, a mirror that hasn't been used. Then you have, let's say, a wall. Mine isn't behind a wall, but a couch behind a wall. Or some, behind something black. There's a little space back there. You want to use a blanket. It fell, but you can see the blanket. Use it to cover all the spots that they could see you from. Sometimes you won't have to. That's how hard it is to find you there. And this one's my favorite. I don't use it very much anymore. And I also blocked off. But see that cabinet? Small one. Right there. I'm going to do this to show you how much space I made in it. So right there. Not too much. But it's going to be hard for you guys to see. It's completely dark. But right there, it's a couple feet of space. Just enough. Hard to get out, but easy to hide in. I mean, no one would have ever got caught me in it once, but since I felt like making scary moves and being loud in there, just so they would get creeped out, I would always hit this. Like that. And I would open this from under. And close it loudly. If this weren't here, it would be louder. But okay, so like I would open it. See how it's kind of loud. I would do that, and they got freaked out. And then I just gave it away because I was being an idiot. Great spot finder, but an idiot. <laughs> and this one I like to use for a different game. See a dresser? It can always be in a different room. But 
then behind here you have a little spot. Ours has a blanket set, but you can sit there, stand there. And then, um, one more. Then you can always hide behind doors. And, huh, I think I have one more, but, oh yeah, then you can hide behind corners with this, with stuff like this here, especially the TV is blocking, but we don't do it, but it is a great spot. So, see you guys next time. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share with your friends if you enjoy. Bye!